Ever wondered why February got the short end of the stick with only 28 days? Well, it's all thanks to a Roman king, Numa Pompilius. In 700 BC, he decided to have a year of 355 days, with each month having an odd number of days. He reduced the days in some months and set February with 28 days. Why you ask? Well Romans believed even numbers were unlucky, so poor February ended up with the only even number left, 28. Later, when the Julian calendar was introduced by Julius Caesar, an extra day was added to February every four years to synchronize the calendar year with the solar year, giving us the leap year system we know today, where February has 29 days every four years. This system was further refined in the Gregorian calendar which is the calendar most of the world uses today.